Even though the transgenders have been officially recognized as a third gender in India, there was always a stigma attached to the community. But in what is seen as a sign of their growing acceptance during the festival of Durga Puja, Eastern West Bengal has installed a first of its kind idol depicting the deity as transgender. This is a historic first. A half man, half woman idol of the Hindu goddess Durga being worshipped by devotees in the eastern Indian city of Kolkata during the ongoing Durga Puja festival. Typically, the goddess Durga is depicted as a woman. But now India's transgender community says it's time they reclaim their space after years of being excluded from these festivities. The element is really that of transgender women who have traditionally been excluded from uh, these co big community pujo events and sort of organizing around it, for them to stake a sort of to stake a claim uh, to be able to organize their own pujo. Uh, more than the religious aspect of it, there is a whole social dimension to to this uh, to this effort, and I think that needs to be recognized. This idol itself is a composite androgynous form of the Hindu god Shiva and his wife, the goddess Parvati. It has been created by Chinapal, who also happens to be the only woman artist in North Kolkata's traditional potter's colony. There are an estimated 500,000 transgender people living in India. And despite the country's highest court recognizing them as a third gender last year, they still face discrimination and marginalization at many levels. Campaigners say they often live in poverty with many singing and dancing at weddings to make a living. <laughs> 